Very good evening everyone. This is Yanu from Bollywood Couch and thank you so much for joining us live. Wishing you all a very happy friendship day. I would like to thank all our associates, our make our beauty partner Vedi, makeup and hair partner Dishanu Bora, accessories partner Truly Mithila, community partner V, media partner Expansion Digital PR, food partner Machi and Indie Fair and education partner SSS Academy. All our dreams can come true if we have the courage to pursue them. Today, we have a very talented model and actress from Indian cinema who started her career with theaters in Bengali films where she had worked with veteran filmmakers like Buddhadeep Das Gupta. She entered Bollywood with uh, with various TV commercials and later made her debut in blockbusters like Simba, Tumba and Article 15. She has done numerous web series and soon would be seen in hot star specials Six Suspects. So ladies and gentlemen boys and girls let's welcome Ronjini Chakravarti the very beautiful skilled actress from Indian cinema. Hi Ronjini I think I can see you yes I can see you so I am just taking her online. I hope she's got my request. Hey Ma hi how are you good how are you very nice it's so nice so nice to have you with us yeah thank you same here <laughs> <laughs> wishing you a very happy friendship day yeah same to you happy friendship <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much <laughs> all right so let's start our today's chat about you know about your life how you have you know come to bollywood let's talk all about it today Yes. Hi, Urmila. Sorry, I. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Surely. Surely. Yes. All right. So, please tell us about your inspiring journey from Kolkata to Mumbai. So, um, so I, so I, I always wanted to be an actor. I was sure of that uh, from the very beginning. So, I started my um, acting journey from theatre. Uh, I used to do theatre in college, and uh, then after that, I got to know. from my theater friends that there is an institute in uh, pune uh, which is the film institute of india ftii and uh, there from there uh, you know uh, there is an acting course there and uh, you know like veterans like uh, 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 shah shabana azmi yeah, uh, many of them yes uh, yeah so they, all of them have uh, you know they have um, graduated and they have graduated you know, yeah so uh, so i was like you know i would uh, i would love to kind of you know apply and uh, yeah and then i got through uh, and then uh, the natural transition was bombay for me uh, and um, i because i from the very beginning i wanted to work on a national platform although you know bomb like uh, like bengal has a very big uh, film industry yes. yeah. bengali film industry is very big but and a lot of my batchmates have also kind of you know uh, gone to their homes and they are doing some wonderful work in their you know regional um, uh place so uh, so yeah so with all my batchmates and classmates uh, you know that was a natural transition from pune to bombay wow so you you mentioned that you you wanted to be an actor from the age of 5 so was there any inspirational model for you or it was just within you or how 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 did you get inspired on that to become an actor um so you know i would say that i come from a very academically oriented family but in spite of yeah. that i really my family is to you know uh, played a very uh, huge role in me uh, you know getting um, kind of you know inspired to be an actor because uh, my family though academically oriented uh, you know they they are and i would say that all my cousins they were very passionate about bollywood so we were very up to date about all the films and you know all of it so uh, so i have been watching hindi films uh, and you know really being uh, kind of you know all these like tip, like all the you know bollywood films were like you know that was my first introduction to like uh, uh, the art of you so know the, acting, um, performing acting. cinema and uh, also what inspired me was that you know every time i used to go to a theater and i used to see a performance or i used to see a film in that you know huge you know like you know blown into that huge uh, thing i used to get goosebumps i used to have i there was an experience which i had never you know kind of 
it's an experience yeah, that i've never before. Been, mm. yeah and i i never put experience in any other you know things like you know um mm. uh like even like my like my parents uh, really wanted to be uh, me to be a singer uh, they also okay. wanted to be a professor a lawyer but you know i really knew and i'm a person who is very uh, emotionally driven and mm. uh, uh, very passionate so i i really wanted to kind of you know take this as a career because uh i wanted to do something that i would really love you know i would love to do for the rest of my life and uh, the desire to really kind of um, uh you know make others feel the same joy and feel uh, big others mm. feel the same good moms through my performance you know it came when i could mm. see i could experience that and i uh, from there you know the desire was there that okay i am going to do something like this which would really kind of you know make others feel that joy and you know that uh, you know wow. experience good mom you yeah <laughs> You are also a trained classical singer, right? Who has been trained for seven long years, if I am not mistaken, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, it, did that also help you somehow to in your acting career? You know, to be a classical trained and a dancer also, right? You are a dancer also, a, a classical I, dancer. Yeah. So I just got like um, I got uh, like very briefly I got trained in uh, uh, Bharat Natyam, but uh, like. Like my mom was like, uh, you know, okay, no, I mean, you should, you know, stick to singing, and you know, uh, but uh, so uh, like, I don't know, like music definitely has a very, uh, I can say, it it has a very uh, uh, organic way of influencing your performance for mm-hmm. sure, as far as rhythm is concerned, you know, uh, you know, it, it's a very unsaid uh, uh, mm-hmm. thing, you know, unsaid on. Un, uh, i mean it ha- it has worked uh, as a performer very silently you can say mm-hmm. because uh, you know understanding the rhythm of a scene for example mm-hmm. you know, understanding mm-hmm. a tone of a scene or the rhythm of a scene you know sometimes being a musician or being a singer or related to music really helps because i feel that mm-hmm. it's like everything is connected so yeah you can say <laughs> wow that's this is really very beautiful okay so uh, you have worked with veteran filmmakers like uh, buddhadeep das gupta so please share about your that experience of yours um well buddhadeep das gupta i think i feel that i feel really proud and fortunate that i have been able to kind of you know work with him he is a veteran and uh, so what we i worked with him on uh, uh, so he, he was making three uh, 13 short uh, you know stories and those 13 okay. short stories uh, are basically 13 short poems of tagore oh and uh, uh, yeah so hi disha <laughs> yeah long time sorry my <laughs> so oh, yeah please uh, yeah so then uh, so there were like you know 13 uh, short um, uh, uh, short, short stories and i was a part of two poems two poems of tagore two short films so um do i didn't get much time to spend with him but you know i could learn a lot and i could uh, you know see him like so he it has like you know so there were many long long shots that he had you know taken in his film it's so, like one one long shot had like was about one and a half to two minutes as a wala and there was a lot of coordination and also you know uh, what really inspired me was his passion you know for his work mm-hmm. and passion Uh, you know what he was doing that always inspires me and uh, i remember one small incident where um, you know uh, i was you know i i wore a sari and the costume designer actually took me to him to see like you no know, for his approval whether the look is fine or not and you know in bengali he said that it was shuchitra shiner moto lagche to shuchitra shiner yeah yeah it's a huge know, compliment yeah yeah and i was like oh my god so like he's like the big uh, you know legend in the bengali yeah. industry beautiful and i'm like so that was like my heart really literally skipped mm-hmm. a beat so <laughs> i will not forget that so so yeah yeah, really, yeah. this is really lovely okay so uh, you entered bollywood through various tvcs you know you have done i think for uh, cadbury's then seven uh, up and many other brands so according to you uh, how do you think that working in a tvc uh, contribute to the journey of an actor 
um well i would say that you know i uh, entered the industry uh, through a feature film like through a hindi feature film mm. ads i have not been uh, too much into uh, ads because uh, i mean i feel that uh ads yeah of course but you know tvc really depends on the script and a uh, lot of things actually and also the face you know you never know when you know you know the face clicks and that you know that association with that brand and that you know uh, uh really kind of gets into uh, uh, uh you know so it it really depends i would say uh, mm. uh but the journey as an as an actor is very is varied like vast, you know you yeah, vast can, Yeah, yeah, it's vast. Like a film, a web show. Now, a web show can also kind of, you know, uh, and and TVC is also kind of, you know, there. So it really depends. Mm. Okay, okay. So now uh, we will have a small rapid fire round. So now there are people who are requesting you to sing a yeah. song in Bengali. So we will do it in the end. When we close the <laughs> okay. interview, we will do it in the end. Sure, sure, sure. I will do that. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Okay, so now uh, we will uh, we will uh, uh, we will do a small uh, rapid fire round. Okay, so you just okay. don't have to think much. Whatever comes in the first thing, you just have to say. Okay. So first is if not. Sure. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Uh, I think your your uh, FTII classmate Mithun is also there online. Oh, is he? Okay. Hi, 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 Mithun. How are you? <laughs> <laughs> yes. all, all them, right so yeah, yeah, yeah all of them have joined you see <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah lovely yeah. yeah so cool yeah ha ah, it's cool union happening yeah <laughs> yeah this is so beautiful <laughs> yeah so let uh, she will surely surely she will uh, she will sing a song urmila is also yes. requesting to sing a song Surely she will. She will in the end of the interview. <laughs> okay, so let's go back to it. So a rapid fire round now. Okay, so if not an actor, what would you have opted for? Um. Well, nothing <laughs> actually. <laughs> Honestly, nothing. I don't have. I never had a plan B, so I don't know. But I have started studying uh, uh, journalism uh, before. You know, while applying, so maybe a journalist. If you know, okay, if, if I just couldn't get out, or I don't know. I mean, I just couldn't. I never had a plan B, so I don't know. <laughs> You are an uh, uh, actor by heart. Ah, huh? there it was a difficult question for you. You had to think about it. If not an actor, then what? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Two hundred. Two hundred. Yes. All right. So, uh, best first date idea for you. <laughs> first date idea. So I think it would be uh, like uh, some wine, some really good meal, and uh, like a great conversation. That would be my mm. ideal first date. Oh, wow. <laughs> Fav uh, favorite fashion trend of all time. So I personally am very comfortable in wearing Indian, uh, but um, I would say um, I think I I love fusion a lot. Uh, I like variety, mm. so I like fusion a lot. Mm. So I would say that the trend would be something fusion. Yeah. Who would you turn to when you were sad? Ah, uh, so I so I practice Buddhism. I practice Nichiren Buddhism. Very wow, charming. This is beautiful. Yeah. So um, so yeah. So that is my go-to when I, you know, when uh, when I really, really, uh, when I'm sad and uh, when I really feel helpless and hopeless. So this is where I turn to when it, uh, really gives gives me a lot of strength. And um, wow. yeah. But, Please yeah. tell us more about it. I think in this pandemic, we all need. Something to calm us. So why don't you tell us a bit more about it? Yes, yeah, so it's um, it's uh, it's it's about uh, so it is um, so there was uh, this um, uh, you know um, uh, Buddhist monk Nichiren Daishonin, and uh, mm. he had uh, uh, you know he had actually kind of you know really uh, uh, uh made this chant uh, Namyo Renge Kyo, and uh, this basically mm. means that when I'm chanting Namyo Renge Kyo, my 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 uh my uh my real potential as a human being it comes out so i am uh, i am myself i am uh, independent uh, independently i can be happy 
because mm. uh, you know uh, so of course like you know when buddha had attained enlightenment he had a lot of buddha mm. in like you know the buddha hood that he has inside he um, you know he believed that every single human being also has a uh, 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 buddha hood which is the highest potential as a human being and we don't realize mm. what potential we mm. have everything is possible you know like mm. the impossible is possible because we have that in us but most of the time we underestimate ourselves because you know either we are scared we are fearful we are anxious and you know we feel defeated because the society is telling us that you know this is not possible and uh, but uh, you know this philosophy says that whatever you feel you know uh, whatever you aim for if you have that faith and conviction in yourself you will be able to achieve it yeah wow, this is so lovely you know this is something very new for us and a very beautiful insight indeed i thank you so much for sharing that with us thank you thank last you. last question of rapid fire round a uh, cutest thing on planet earth cutest thing i think i think my parents are the cutest thing oh. <laughs> they're the cutest thing on planet earth for sure this is so sweet yeah someone is asking you are you single <laughs> Well, <laughs> who is asking? I don't know. Uh, Bhargav is asking. <laughs> okay, hi Bhargav. <laughs> well, I I I I I have a partner. Mm, that's new. <laughs> <But don't... laughs> okay. Sure. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Yes. So how how have you kept yourself motivated during the pandemic situation? um yeah so of course uh, this is something that i spoke about that really kind of you know helped me uh, uh, stay motivated yeah. also i got the opportunity to watch a lot of you know uh, content on uh, uh, you know mm. on internet and uh, mm. so you know like really watching uh, like you know I, i was really blown away by patal lok and by you know by mm. uh, by by shows other like mm. other than patal lok that you know so many performances that really inspired me you know mm. and you know and of course i feel that inspiration is very important to you know get you going sure. so that sure. you know so uh, i feel that yeah so watching um, uh, watching shows and uh, reading and yeah this kept me going and of course my sure. practice of buddhism for sure <laughs> wow, this is this is wonderful yeah this is really wonderful uh how was your debut experience experience in blockbusters like uh, simba tumbad and article 15 how did you prepare for its auditions and how have you cracked it so uh, i start with tumbad tumbad is a very special film and i feel that tumbad is uh, something that uh, i uh, it is a film that you know even after many 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 years i'll be like like yes this was you know in my filmography there is a film called tumbad and i'm really proud of it so you know one tick mark is there and uh, so it was a very normal audition and i had gone for an aud- audition and um, just uh, you know uh, the i got shortlisted and i didn't know that it is going to be such a big film you know i didn't know i didn't know uh, the you know history beha- behind the film and all of that and uh, so and of course like you know i, I remember that uh, you know the director what really really loved my audition and he really wanted me to be a part of it and but the producers were you know they were thinking because i didn't look like a konkanas maharashtrian which was the character so there was a couple of look that happened and uh, where i was put in like those blue gray lenses my hair was kind of you know like a different look altogether and uh, so after that you know they they really kind of you know um, they really they were like okay fine you know we can kind of you know we can go for it and uh, mm. and then i remember when i had before even we started shooting people started calling me and congratulating me and they were like hey, you know that you know, congratulations you are a part of tumbad and i was like acha like i'm getting like calls is it like that big and all then of course i got to know that this is a mm. film that speaks about in the industry that you know and it's mm. been like the past like 10 years the film has been mm. trying to be made you right. know all of that so um, yeah and then um, so it was amazing it was amazing then uh, first article 15 also it was an audition and um, and uh, i i remember that uh, i had audition for another part 
but then uh, like it was a very last minute thing and then uh, anubhav sir you know said that you know please you know uh, would you like to do this part and it was it was an amazing experience as well and um, i just uh, 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 and the experience was another level of like great fun and all then uh, simba was uh, something that happened it uh, i already had worked with uh, rohit sir so i was you know working with him already so you know he knew me and he was like hey, you know apparently i'm the first person to be cast on the film so i was like yeah okay oh wow <laughs> yeah, <apparently laughs> this is pretty. really great <laughs> so, so they were like yeah okay fine you know we have something for you. So, yeah <laughs> oh, this is great. So your uh, your uh, your your FTII friends, you know, Urmila and uh, our Badri has also joined, and they are all telling you hi. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. We should meet, yeah. We haven't met for like so long, and I want to congratulate them uh, also for you know for getting married. They are lovely. Have <laughs> been like we like yeah. Hi. I hope you guys are doing well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There are questions about how, how did you audition for uh, Shyamni's part in Article Fifteen? Yes, I did. I did. Yes. Then the Tumar M M X player Raktanchal web series on Nick Bhalo Hoche. They have oh, loved the. Oh, thank. She's loved the Raktanchal web series. Okay, and who's thank your you. favorite actor? Who's your favorite actor? There is a question from the audience. Oh, okay, okay. So you know, in uh, so right now, so there are many favorites, but right now I have discovered uh, this actor in the pan- pandemic. So this is something uh, I would like to give <laughs> credit to. Be not. I think you it's know, all I of got, us. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So I got. Uh, I have yeah. discovered this actor, Fahad Fazl, and uh, I feel that now he's got to be my favorite. I feel um, he's just. Mm. I mean, he's another level. He's he's <laughs> amazing. Like I feel like yes. watching all his like seriously for the all his work. <laughs> yeah, and also like Samantha. Uh, Samantha, mm. I saw her in Family Man too, and I was like, oh my god! Like you know, this is something I would like. You know, you know, very inspiring. Very inspiring. Yeah. yeah. Then uh, uh, okay, people are asking you for yoga tips. <laughs> yoga tips. <laughs> I am. I am a person who is very confused about my fitness <laughs> tips and all of that. I am still trying to, you know, I am. I am still searching for uh, fitness tips. No yoga tips actually. I, I think yoga. I can say that, and you should do it every day. Cust <laughs> consistency is the key. So yeah, uh. you, you do it every day. That's the. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you have you had worked as an actor assistant with uh, Rohit Shetty in Glo- uh, Golmal Returns. So uh, please share about that experience. You know uh, how does an uh, actor assistant works, and how did it help you to you know shape up your career, and how was yeah. it working as that? So uh, I was a part of uh, like. so i was uh, an actor assistant there so what we did was we were a team of three actors and we used to like uh, lead the team we used to perform it and we used to like you know we used to kind of uh, uh, play it out in front of the actors who are you know who are, who are actually playing the part and we used to improvise and we you know make the theme and uh, they used to kind of uh, oh hi shine is here hello yeah shine is there yes <laughs> yes 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 So yeah, so hi, so uh, uh, so yeah, so we just kind of you know uh, we played it out in front of uh, you know uh, them, and then of course they uh, we rehearsed it and all of that, and then the scene was made. So the experience was um, great. I would say it was a like learning experience. We had like we were there like we were. uh the schedule was like of an eight months we we shot in mumbai hyderabad uh, goa and then you know the entire you know uh, it was literally like a silent kind of a learning and lot of observation from my part where i was for the first time a part of a huge bollywood set like bollywood blockbuster set where you know mm. and uh, and you know like we ma- uh, you know what i realized was that you know we might have our own choice of uh, mm. you know of 
films and uh, we might not we, we might like or we might not like them but the effort mm. behind uh, you know uh, uh, these films like you know uh, mm. uh, and of course there are so mm. uh, it's amazing it, it's it's humongous effort and it's like a ca- collect, it's, it's, collective yes, effort yes. that you know goes behind of so many uh, people hmm. yeah and of course like you know rohit sir was like you know or some he is like a team man like you know like all the the team is like working for him uh, for the past 8 9 years and uh, mm. you know the way and you know everybody really really loves him respects him and uh, and 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 you know the way he t- treats even the spot boy to you know it is like a lot of love and mm. care it's like a family that he it's had like a family probably mm. yeah 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 so there was lot of kind of you know it was like a family thing only like the writers and everybody let me working together for a long time so so yeah it was it was great fun lot of learning and uh, yeah <laughs> it was great fun there is something that uh, some yeah spoona me sharing that would like to share this wasn't interested to watch raktanchal then got to know you were there watched it in a go and loved oh. you like always <laughs> thank you thank you so much thank you so much ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, there is one more question i want to take admission in ftii please suggest um i think uh, you can go on their online uh, uh, you can go to their website and also i feel that um, there is a lot of info, info and there is also a facebook page uh, on uh, like it's called ftii wisdom tree i think or or he search fdii on facebook there's okay. a group and you can you can coordinate and you can so like, online you know, yeah yeah you can so online i think they will get it okay yeah 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 because you know rules and everything has changed a lot so okay yeah can go ahead <laughs> Oh great. So uh many congratulations for being the part of Hotstar series Six Suspects uh which is a Ajay Devgan production. So anything you would like to share about it to our audience? Uh so I'm not supposed to reveal that much but I'll, all I can say is that it's uh, directed by Tig Tigmanchu Dulia and um it has a great ensemble uh cast. Uh, it has uh, Richa Chadha, it has Pratik Gandhi has a shashank arora and um ashutosh rana raghuveer yadav and all of these like you know giant talent uh, <laughs> of you know and um yeah it's going to like uh, maybe by the end of the year i guess uh, it's not oh. fixed this yeah so it's going to be like the trailer will be out in a month or two but yeah it's going to be something very very big and yeah in- Yeah, lovely. We really wish you all the best, and I, I, we are, we, we are all waiting eagerly to watch it. So, uh, so before I go ahead, I think, I think this is the, this demand has become very high that you please sing a Bengali song, please sing a song. So let's do that first. Please, I request you please sing a song for all of us. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Sure, sure, sure. It's a so, public demand uh, now. Someone has mentioned. I know. <laughs> <laughs> now i'm going to think what what do i sing okay fine i'll sing a bengali song so um yeah maybe like few like so yeah mm-hmm. okay, this is something that, this is a song which i sing every day like every day not every day but every every time i i am asked to sing it, i this song yeah yeah this is the go to song so yeah it has sure. a hindi version or as people who are not bengali can um, you know uh, understand like they can relate to the song so there's a hindi song of, of this as well So, <laughs> Shine is also a, a like a beautiful singer, beautiful singer by the way. So, <laughs> so yes. So, na je ho na, to jo ni akono baki, aro ki chudi te baki. बोले रात जागा पाखी ना जे तुम्हारे शुदू जीवन मरो जे तुम्हारे शुदू जीवन मरो 
धुरिया राखीते चाहे नयोने नयोने ना जियो ना रजोनी एकोनो बाकी आरो के छुदी ते बाकी बोले रात जागा पाखी ना जियो ना <laughs> this is so i had complete goosebumps you had such a you have such a sweet voice wow you. you know what the question which i had asked you know what would you had become if not an actor i am sure definitely <laughs> let be a singer i am very sure about it it's wonderful you know it's really wonderful it's so sweet you such a sweet voice you have beautiful yeah really really it's really beautiful everyone Thanks. has loved it really everyone has loved it all are oh. mentioning about it it's really awesome thank you so much for doing that for us this is really wonderful thank you thank you so much <laughs> all right so we are coming towards the end of the interview so any mess any message for our audience um yes so yeah please stay safe covid is not over so uh, please uh, take the safe like safe precautions wear your mask wash your hands keep doing it because uh we really don't want the third wave to come so please be safe and uh, uh yeah and spread a lot of love around and just be happy yeah and uh, any special message for bollywood couch yes i would like to wish all the uh, you know wish bollywood couch a lot of luck and uh, i uh, i would uh, like would like to see more and more uh, uh you know artists coming in the interviews and uh, you know uh, doing such live uh, sessions and i hope that there are more and more beautiful live sessions with a lot of artists uh, and uh, yeah wishing all the best thank you. you thank you so much thank you so much all right so now it's almost the end of the interview but now we will take the audience question and answers there are a lot of questions which has just come up but before i go to the audience questions uh, I would like to just uh, thank all our associates once again, and I would also like to share that Bollywood Couch. In Bollywood Couch, we are tr we are trying to promote a bunch of women entrepreneurs who are trying to do something on their own and contribute their best to the country. So, uh, so we have with us a beauty partner Vedi, our accessories partner Truly Mithila, uh, community partner We. We is again a woman entrepreneur enclave. uh then food partner machi and uh, education partner sss academy and also we have with us our food partner indi fair makeup and hair partner dishanu bora and our media partner expansion digital pr all right so now let us go back to our audience oh okay <laughs> what does ronjini means oh ronjini means <laughs> a person who spreads happiness and uh, oh, yeah lovely uh, <laughs> uh, this is lovely. Mm, let me see what else. I think we have answered most of that. You know? Yes, mo mostly. Yeah. Okay. I realize it's 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 so late that you have we were you were in uh, Panch. I used to watch it when I was kid. Uh, oh, this is mentioned oh, yes. by someone. Ah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. I'll just go through once. So, audience, you can ask your questions now. We are there, there to take the questions. Mm. I think she's already mentioned most of them. Thank you. How do you maintain Thank your you. fitness? Ah, <laughs> uh, so I am basically trying to eat on time and uh, trying to. Uh, do uh, exercise uh, like exercise every day and uh, mm. trying to eat local seasonal and um, uh, you know food every day and uh, trying to yeah trying to eat clean every day so you know so that it becomes so no like, junk like a way of yeah 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 no junk and you know just it becomes a way of life rather than being mm. like lifestyle that, yeah 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 mm. so trying nice. to So, what are your dreams? Um, your dreams. My dreams are actually, as I mentioned, you know, what inspired me to be an actor is my dream to be, uh, uh, you know, make 
many 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 millions of people in the in the country and in the world experience the same thing that i experience every time you know watching uh, mm. a great performance you know i really want mm. to that's my dream and uh, my dream is mm. that ki uh, so that my performance reaches out to as many people uh, you know uh, at, you know as many people as there are they, they are like you know the country and in the world so yeah and i wish you all the best yeah thank you thank yeah, you yeah please come again yeah please come again you mentioned something yeah and uh, yeah i want to like you know really bring them a lot of joy through my performance that's you ah. know <laughs> we, we wish you all the best and i'm sure that you know you will you will you'll, you'll really get what you dream of you will be known all across the world for all uh-huh. your awesome performances thank you thank you <laughs> please share about your uh, upcoming projects uh my upcoming project is one is uh, six aspects the other is uh, raktanchal season 2 which is coming and uh, yeah so these are the two uh, oh, season 2 mm. okay so mm, ma'am who is your dream uh, dream uh, favorite dream actor who whom you would like to meet uh i am so i'm a big uh, well i and i'll go like i'm a big srk fan and i would mm. i would love to meet him one day just to tell him that how much he was like how much i admire him and you know how he was my childhood you know like just to kind of mm. you know i'm sure he must be uh, having getting the, yeah these things from millions of people but uh, really wish to meet him one day and oh. uh, Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, 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 he was a very, very important part in my childhood. You know, like you know, watching films and watching his, you know, like, yeah. So, well, yeah. So I'm sure you will meet him soon. Sometime. I'm, I'm very yeah, sure I, you will I, meet him soon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. What is one role from any time or industry that you would wish you have, uh, you would have done? Any role? Um. Well, I can say the the This recent is a good question. yeah it's a very good question actually the uh, you know the role that actually uh, really was uh, recent that, that's fresh in my mind which will come right now because otherwise i'll take a lot of time to <laughs> remember but uh, uh, this is uh, the role that samantha did uh, for the family man mm. too i family that, too mm. uh, my god like the you know the transition and you know like um, the character she played and she played with so much like you know dignity it's uh, amazing i feel that um, i was really literally blown away you know like mm. literally blown away by such a performance so you know i would like to you know do such roles mm. and you know be, mm. uh, uh yeah i would like love to yeah this is something that i can like think of right now um yeah something that yeah this is great so a uh, recent uh, favorite watches or any recommendations a uh, recent watches so as i mentioned that you know i uh, i really got to uh, so uh, you know uh, i got to see uh, some of uh, a very like fine performances in the uh, you know in some really good malayali uh, malayalam films so i think oh. joji is that you know i feel that um one should watch for like part pass performance there is joji there is uh, um, there is great indian kitchen that's really um, that, that's also something that i really loved uh there is another film which i can't remember um mm, mary and malcolm uh that's okay. also another i mean this is not really new but this is something that i really i remember uh you know ha- i watched mm. it a few months back and uh, mm. the performance and the film everything like really means amazing and one thing that i think i'm, I'm currently watching is the last dance it's a documentary on oh. uh, michael jordan it's on netflix so please don't uh, oh. um, yeah 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 it's it's, it's the last amazing. dance the oh. last dance yeah, yeah it's okay charlie thank you so much you know i'm sure that since the recommendations come from you i'm sure it is 
this all will be worth a watch so all these are there in all this ott platforms only yes 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 all of them yeah all yeah yeah them. Great, great, great. So, uh, okay. So, please say something on about the Olympic uh, Power Woman. Ah, uh, well, I think the women are leading the way, man. Like the way uh, <laughs> I feel. Uh, the I mean, uh, uh, you know, uh, the news are coming. It's coming. It's amazing. I feel that. Uh, uh, well, I. We should just keep on encouraging. Uh, you know. Um, this and i think that it's going to get better and better you know we are going to see more and more uh, you know such achievements uh, and uh, yeah yeah totally it is it's another level of inspiration i feel that yes. you know i mean i mean i feel these achievements are giving um, us inspiration to so many women who are there mm-hmm. in the in the corners of uh, you know of, of uh, the world of uh, you know in the country where you know where they are told that you can you know you can achieve only this much you know your destiny is still there mm-hmm. you know mm-hmm. there are so many uh, conditions and so many things that are you know literally forced upon us because you are born into a family like this because you are born to a society like this or because you are from a certain small town you know mm-hmm. certain rural very rural part when very you know dur mein kahi to ho wahan se kaise hi tum you know so mm. i feel that um these things are very uh, uh, i think these the it's like an achieve uh, these achievements are uh, you know it's a great ex- it's great example for all those women who who you know silently they dreaming they are wishing so many things but they d- probably they can't like they don't they are not able to um, express their dreams only you know you know uh, like i feel like i'm fortunate that the fact that you know uh, i have i'm doing what i love doing but so many people they are not they have just conveniently they have just kind of you know um wo hota hai na ki apne khwahish aur dreams ko sab daba ke rakh diya hai because mm. you know it's not possible you know so yeah very well said you know yeah very well said actually so true you know and, and, and there was also a time when we have seen that women you know they not even you know they were not even had the you know they were not allowed to dream they were never asked you know what to do what you want to do and i really wish you know now actually a very right you know to seeing such women coming up and then you know uh, you know achieving so high there'll be a lot of people you know a lot of women and you know, a lot of girls you know who dream to you know chase for such things this is really yeah. wonderful you know what you mentioned yeah this is really great so one last question i think i'll take uh have you acted in any malayalam movie no but i want to i haven't but i really okay. really want this is my thing that i'm like throwing into the universe i would love to work in a malayalam film yeah <laughs> okay so there is one question <laughs> this is from punam he is mentioning that please sing rafu na once if possible i have heard it from you once and as it sung from your mentor you sing it so good please oh okay 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 so show sure, okay i just hope i get the lyrics right i just yeah and i hope she's not online <laughs> yeah okay <laughs> you know what i i i forgot the lyrics wait this is i i'll just sing the tune because i've forgotten the lyrics hmm okay. na 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 kabhi dhoop kabhi chhao na 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 kuch tune ki hai maine hi mera phool ye doriya kuch tune ki hai maine hi mera phool ye doriya teri bani rahe मेरी थी दीवारे उन दीवारों पे मैंने ही लिख ली बहारे शाम हुई तू जो आया सो रही थी कलिया फिर शाम हुई तू जो आया सो गई थी कलिया कुछ मैंने की है तूने सी है ये डोरिया कुछ मैंने सी है तूने सी है रफू 
Nidoria. Wow, you're such a beautiful singer. You have got, you are blessed with this sweet voice. It is so lovely, you know. It's very uh, lovely. I <laughs> sing in my own film something. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. I even I, even I too wish that you know. Sometimes we we hear you in in your film. You know yourself singing your song, which you act for. This will be amazing. Yeah. This is so lovely, Ranjini. It was wonderful to have you with us. and all our audiences have really loved you loved your voice the interview you were really so sweet anything and anything you, anything else you want to share anything else you want to share with us um as a closing think, message uh, i think thank you to all of you who have joined uh, the live and uh, who have left also but i feel that thank you so much for joining and uh, like giving me so much love and uh, uh questioning like you know like uh, putting uh, putting out all those lovely questions uh thank you i would love to you know work really hard and i really want to do my best and uh, um yeah do really really good films and really um entertain you guys and i hope i'm able to spread the love that uh, you know you are, you know you guys are giving and, and i hope that i can you know make that love um uh you know uh like fulfill that love that you are you guys are kind of you know showering upon me so thank you so much thank you very much yes this is this is so awesome yeah this is lovely ronjini and thank you everyone for joining us live and we wish you all the best ronjini you fly high with lot of wonderful flying colors you know spread your wings and just fly all the best yeah, thank, thank you so you. much for having thank us much. having you yeah Thanks. coming here thank you so much bye bye take care lots of bye. love yeah. bye yeah thank you thank you to you thank you so much bye bye thank